Let's write the decimal. 1.5 is an improper fraction and then is a mixed number. And here's how we could do that. First off, let's call it 1.5 over 1. That way we have the start of a fraction. What we need to do is get our decimal 1.5 to be a whole number. And the way we could do that is if we multiplied 10 times 1.5, that would give us 15. But we'll also need to multiply the denominator by 10. That's because 10 over 10 is just 1. So we're multiplying this by 1. We don't change anything, just the way it's represented. 10 times 1.5, that gives us that 15. There's our whole number. And 10 times 1, that's 10. So we have an improper fraction, the decimal 1.5. That gives us this improper fraction 15 over 10. We say it's an improper fraction because the top number, the numerator, is larger than the denominator. We could simplify this further, though. So 5 goes into 15 and 10. So 3 times 5 is 15. 2 times 5 is 10. So our greatest common factor is 5. So now we've simplified this 15 tenths down to 3 halves. So 1.5, that's the same as 15 tenths, or 3 halves. Let's convert the improper fraction here to a mixed number. So 2 goes into 3 one time with 1 left over. Bring the denominator across, and that's 2. So 2 goes into 3 one time. That's the whole number with 1 left over. Denominator comes across. This is Dr. B converting the decimal 1.5 to an improper fraction. That's 3 over 2 and a mixed number, one and one half. Thanks for watching.